we have a, a word here with uh, Taylor Johnston, Scotsman by birth, lives in London and now does all his racing in Belgium. Taylor, what do you think of our racing over here? It's uh, it's much tougher than you sort of it gets the credit for. Definitely, um, there's a lot of strong riders that uh, they're very uh, like uh, not many people know about, but phew, a hell of a riders here, and uh, the terrain of the races is always up and down and grippy, so it uh, can't be underestimated. You're very close in the classification uh, on the on the 23 competition, one that I'm really looking at. Uh, you also, you're, uh, you're top 10 probably in the general classification today again, close, you know, top 15, at least not top 10, I don't know where you uh, arrived. You've been consistent all weekend and uh, you showed yourself really, the team have been working hard for you today because they tried to get you up today, they tried everything they could, it didn't work this time, but my God, uh, you show some tea work. We will see. It. We will see it on the photographs of the Belgian project uh, very soon as well. Uh, that David here took. Uh, so, so generally, what are your plans now for uh, the rest of the year? The rest of the year is just to continue uh, progressing in the racing I do. So the Kermis racing and the interclub level. Um, I've got a couple of goals later in the year at big interclubs and uh, maybe the nationals. I'd like to get a result there. I think I'm capable, but um, there's a bit of training and mental preparation to go before I can uh, reach the goals I need to. Well, I have noticed, all, I've, you've been staying with us all weekend and I noticed one thing, you're a very tidy man. That is something that uh, a lot of youngsters are going to have to learn when they go abroad because uh, uh, you already know how to look after yourself. Yeah, I've, um, I used to be quite a messy person, but um, I've been like in a British programme and the Scottish programme for years. So they've always brought me up to be tidy, keep your things in order because there's less stress and you can just focus on what sort of the job in hand. So um, it's a big part, especially when people like yourself take us in and give us some good hosp hospitality. So, OK, tell, uh, tell, thank you for talking to you. I nearly said Johnny here, you know, but uh, uh, thanks for talking. And uh, it was a privilege to have you in my home. Brilliant. Thank you, Danny, for everything. That's it.